How y'all doing tonight? Ethan Waters coming in live for another episode of Adventures with Ethan Waters. I hope y'all are having a fantastic night tonight. It's a beautiful day out as you can see. Uh, the temperatures have been in the 40s and 50s pretty much all day. So that's Ethan's kind of weather. Kind of weather he likes to get a book and wrap up in a nice cozy quilt and eat some SpaghettiOs with some chocolate milk. It's one of those type nights y'all. I hope y'all are having an incredible night too. But main reason I'm making this video today is uh, a lot of people like to ask Ethan, Ethan, how do you get so many birds in your yard? I mean, people try all the time to get birds and critters in their yard. Ethan's yard's always flooded with birds. So I'm here to tell y'all tonight how to get more birds into your yard. Y'all stay tuned and I'm gonna teach y'all how to do this now. Step one, incredible bird seed. This is 75 cents a bag. It might break you a little bit, but it's worth it, y'all. Uh, this bird seed right here gets every bird from Africa to South America in your backyard within 24 hours. So this is made with millet, milo, and black oil sunflower seed. So this right here is what you need to get. Uh, find it at local gas stations, usually in the back, because I think they're so popular, they just, they don't have them on the shelf. One of those special type deals. So step two is going to be getting you a big whopping handful of this stuff and then dispersing it. The dispersing it is the key part, but Ethan's got a pretty good way of dispersing it. Y'all need to stay tuned for it. So this is going to be step two here, y'all, the bird feed. So you want to reach down and get you at least this much bird feed right here. That's part of step two. Like I said, step two is the most important step of this process. So got your big old whopping handful of bird seed. So you want to get over here real close to the yard because you don't want any of this on the concrete. You want this to go in the grass and any, any near any type trees at all because this stuff's going to stick like peanut butter everywhere. So you can take this. Now you don't want to you don't want to choke on it. You're going to have some probably go down the throat. That's all right, that's all right. We can get that out later and then disperse it that way. But what you want to do is get it in your mouth and get it nice and saturated. And then you want to just sprinkle it across the yard like such. <coughs> so that's how you get it dispersed out like that right there. And you want to get it dispersed across the whole yard because you're gonna have competition from certain birds wanting to eat certain food. So if you spit it all in one spot, the birds are not gonna come around. They're gonna be spooked by the other birds. So you wanna disperse it over a big area of the yard. You wanna repeat that step at least 17 times a day. That's gonna really bring different species in at all times a day. And it's gonna give you that enjoyable backyard you've always wanted. You can come out here anytime you want and enjoy the chirping, and the mating calls, and the just hopping around, having a good time out here, y'all. That's what it's all about. Uh, if y'all got any questions about this method or Ethan's bird seed or whatever y'all got, just leave a comment. Y'all make sure and like this video and subscribe, and I'll be back. I thank y'all for joining Ethan on this episode of Adventures with Ethan Waters. 